Hey guys, I'm making a video today on the flow state again. I'm gonna get more specific with you about the flow state and how I get into the flow state. And I've got some questions and comments um, about that, some emails about that, about wanting me to get into more detail. And that's what I'm gonna do today. I'm gonna tell you my own technique that I use. I'm gonna try to get as much detail into this as possible to help you guys um, to recreate my own imaginal or my own meditation technique where it puts me into the flow state where I can actually make picks and I can create things and in the, in the, it's a direct line to God to give me the answers to whatever I'm looking for. And I'm going to give you guys that today. But if you like this sort of practice, you like me getting into more detail with you and specific, hit the like button now because we want to get this out to as many people as possible. That way they can all join our, join our team because I believe that this sort of practice and meditations and the things that I teach should be taught in schools. So I want to try to get these videos out to as many people as possible. And everyone needs to know this, these techniques and everyone's to spread the love and the joy and the gratitude and just live an abundant life. And we're all like that. I believe we can change the world. But OK, I'm going to get right into it. OK, my own meditation practice to get into the flow state is I'll get into a half lotus position or I'll sit and I'll keep my body completely erect. I'll keep my body completely concentrated because I find that when my body is concentrated and in an upright position and completely, you know, um, about face, you know, completely just erect and concentrated, my mind will be more directed. and I'll be able to control it much easier. So this is what I like to do in the very beginning of my meditation exercise. I'll get into the half lotus position and um, what I'll do is I'll do about 30 breaths. I'll do my I'll do my breathing where I'll breathe in four times, four seconds. I'll breathe in and then I'll hold it for a few seconds. I mean, I'm not really big on, you know, all the exact seconds of it. Just I get in there. I'm just trying to have a, I'm trying to have fun. I'm trying to have a good time. I'm trying to, you know, really bring peace into me and to get into this flow state. And what I'll do is after I complete my breathing techniques, I will I practice this exercise where I tell myself or in meditation, after I after I, I get really calm, my blood pressure has dropped. I've dropped my blood pressure. I'm completely calm and relaxed and in a peaceful state. I will tell myself, not out loud, but in my mind, I will tell myself that I that I was just born. I'll, I'll, I'll meditate on this idea that I don't have a past, that I was just born right now. I have no past. I have nothing to worry about. There's no future. Nothing happened to me yesterday. I'm not obligated to do anything. Okay, all I was just born. I have no thoughts. I've never had any thoughts. And I'll and I'll bring this into my meditation to where it completely calms me and it just frees me of all my past mistakes, of all the things that have happened or things that I need to do and just conquer all these things that I have, this, you know, the empire. If you want to build an empire or whatever it is, you let all that go in this meditation by just by meditating on that feeling that you were just born, just born one second ago, what would you do? What would you be thinking? Where does your mind go? You know, when you've got nothing to worry about, you never had any problems ever in your life. Okay. This is what I do after my breathing. And then what I'll do when I get that, when I get that state, I'll, then I will create the scene, whatever it is. Like when I did the imagining, um, winning the $50,000 on the sports betting ticket, what I did is I created that scene in that in that state of just being completely at peace. What that brings is just your your mind just slows and it stops, and you're able to just direct your mind to wherever you want it to go. And you, and this helps me with with visualization. This helps me with with my blood pressure. This helps me with with creating all sorts of things. If you can, and it helps you get into that meditative state where your mind's not drifting everywhere. It's completely calm and it makes it easier to focus on one thing. So this is what I do. I drive, I'm in a half lotus position. I do my breathing and then I do the meditation where I was just born. I, I really cement that into my mind with meditation, breathing at the same time. And then I, then I create the scene. Like I created the scene of my family member coming and picking me up. You just won $50,000. Okay. So I'm really in this scene and, but I play this in a loop. Okay. I'll do this for 10 to 30 minutes, sometimes up to an hour. And, but I'll get into this, I'll, I'll play it in a loop, you know, like a, like a five, 10, maybe even a 30 second loop if I get that far into it. And um, I'll create this whole loop and I'll do this for 10, 30, maybe an hour. I'll continue this exercise in my mind. And then what it'll do is it'll put me into that state. And once I get into that future state and I'm looking back on myself, basically I'm so absorbed into that imaginal act that I can look back on myself in the lotus position, imagining that I was just born, I was just doing that meditation, I'm looking back at myself laughing, you know, oh, that was me, okay, that was the past, but really it's the present. So I'm shocking time sense at the same time, but as soon as I pull myself back, when I see myself 
in the future, looking back upon myself into this flow state, that's when I come back into my body. That's when I can make these picks because I've been in the future. I've created the act in the future. So when I come back, there's going to be a sequence of events that are going to happen to lead me to that end. So I have this feeling of belief. I have this feeling of letting go, of relief. Everything is happening. Everything's going to happen, you know, just the way that I imagine it. And I have that, that belief deep down inside me because I was there. I have created that. I believe, I believe in my creation because I've been doing this so long and it's so real to me that I made the picks based on that flow state that I got into. So I make my picks based on that as soon as I come out. Any decisions that you ever need to make, make these decisions. If there's any big, any big decisions you got to make in your life, get into this flow state and make your decisions after you come out, after you created your imaginal act. And you can also do this. I do this also if, I, if there's not a, a definite purpose of what I'm trying to create. What I'll do is I'll get into the meditative state with the breathing and then I'll tell myself that I was just born. And then I'll, I'll clear my mind completely. And when I come out, I'm at peace and I'll make decisions based on that. Not necessarily always going into the imaginal act in the future, but just going into this meditative state and making decisions um, afterwards. After I go into this meditative state for about 30 minutes, I'll create, an, I'll, I'll create or I'll make decisions when I come out you know, like decisions with family members, with my job, with creating things, um, anything like any sort of decisions I need to make, everything will just come clear to me. And when I get out, because my ego is released from my body, my ego is no longer there. And I'm making decisions not based on ego, but love and gratitude and peace. And when I make decisions like that, an abundance of great things just come into my life and um, it just unfolds and these things, just great things happen to me. But um, all right, guys, I wanted to share this with you, this, this technique, and I hope you really care. I hope you really like this. And don't forget to hit the like button and um, leave your comments and questions in the, in the box below. And um, I'm going to read those. I read those periodically. And so this way I know where you guys are at and I want to make more videos based on what you guys love. And um, I really hope you love this video and I'm going to get this one out and I appreciate you guys. Love you. Have a good day.